Hey everyone, Richard here with thewirelesshaven.com. Today we're going to go over using your PoE input via the WAN port. You're going to need to hook up to your router and then connect to it with a browser. I like to always use a private or incognito tab on my browser. You're going to want to put in the IP address of your router. If it's the base IP address that comes with it, it's 192.168.11. Once the login screen loads up, put in your password. If you don't have a password set yet, you can leave it blank and then click on the login button. Once the UI loads up, we're going to need to navigate to the network menu and we're going to be looking at the interfaces submenu. Once here you'll see all the different interfaces including the LAN and WAN interface. And these are where we're going to be doing some settings but not directly. What you want is up at top it says devices. Click on this tab and then you'll notice at the very top should be there is a LAN device that's set up as a bridge device. We're going to configure this. Once you've clicked on the configure button you'll notice that there shows a part that says bridge ports and a listing of each of the LAN ports but not the WAN port. Not yet. Click on the drop down and you'll notice that it shows four switch ports for LANs 1 through 4. And there's another one that says switch port WAN. If it shows two, make sure you select both of them. You want to have all the switch ports selected. Once you have them all selected, you'll notice on the bridge ports, it shows all of them there in line. Now it's added the WAN. Click on save. and click on save and apply. These configurations will set up pretty quickly and once it shows that they're saved and applied and reloads the page you can even click on it again you'll see that it is in fact there. But we want to go ahead and reboot the router to make sure that these settings are all well set. Sometimes it does some weird things if you don't. So go to system, reboot, and click on the reboot router button. Perform reboot. Now rebooting should take about a minute, minute and a half, but we'll fast forward through that part so that we don't have to wait a solid minute for no reason. If it doesn't do it in that quick of time, if it takes a little longer, just push the refresh button on the browser. Once it's done, you'll log back in to the main login page. Use your password if you've set one. Once it loads back in, if you'll notice we haven't actually disconnected from the router to connect via the WAN interface. And if you go over to the interfaces, network interfaces menu, you'll see that LAN has shown that it's just booted, but we're only transmitting data on LAN. You look down at the WAN port and you'll see that we actually haven't transmitted any data. So what we're going to do while I'm showing the recording live is I'm going to unplug the Ethernet port and I'm going to plug into the WAN port. So from LAN port to WAN port. You can watch it happen on the settings. We just unplugged it from the Ethernet LAN port and then we're plugging back into the WAN port to prove that we're using the WAN port for data passing and you'll watch it actually start to connect in our settings. You see it identifying now. So it sees the WAN port plug in and the page will actually reload once it recognizes something new. See here, it shows that now we're resetting our connection. And you'll notice now we have data passing on the WAN port, transmitting and receiving. It will also show it in the LAN port And if we go to the overview page, just to show that we are accessing over this port, it is loading data. You'll notice that it shows data is passing on the LAN port as well. And though the mouse doesn't show it here while we're clicking around on the screen, if you look at the little green bar where it says LAN, there's actually five switch pictures of switch ports there. One for each of the Ethernet LAN ports and one for the WAN port. 
and you'll see that we are passing data and we are connected via Ethernet, not Wi-Fi. This has been Richard with TheWirelessHaven.com. Appreciate your time. Take care.